It's FM 98 WJLB. It's a four play for a count down. We're counting them down right now. Four, three, two, one. Uh, we're online. You can watch the stream and live video. Tiffany Green from the BET Awards. Now, if you're uh, somewhere been sleeping up under a rock or something like that and you not know who Tiffany is, Tiffany is from Flat Rock, Michigan. From she, Detroit, Michigan. But Detroit, Detroit right yeah. Now. But you live in Flat Rock now. Excuse me. <laughs> Smack me. Uh, uh, she won a big contest with uh, BET and uh, got the chance to be on stage. And some things happened and went wrong and she went viral. Literally. You, you, before we even got back on the transportation to go back to the hotel before the after party, you were already on YouTube. That's just, but you know what's pretty amazing, though, that they actually let people in the awards with the iPad 2s. And they were oh, videotaping. Yes. See, I didn't know that. Oh, yeah, they were doing a whole lot of stuff like that. Now, we're going to get to your explanation of what happened and what actually transpired and, and how things went wrong and how you feel about it. Um, but you're doing a lot of things right now. Uh, and today, uh, coming up at 5 o'clock, you're going to be on... Fox 2 News. Fox 2 News. So you can check it out on Fox 2 News. And then this evening at 6.30? Yes. You're going to be on Access, Access Hollywood. Access Hollywood, yeah. You're doing big things. And then we were talking earlier on the phone. You did say BET called you? Yeah, they did. Um, they called. I actually spoke with someone earlier. And, you know, they just, they've been really gracious about it all. You know, they apologized and... Um, just wanted to make sure that I'm holding up okay because they saw all the blogs and everything. So, right. You know, there's no bad blood between me and BT. I'm really so grateful for it, just to have been there. So, right. And then, and then, and when I was talking to the people from BT, they told me you actually almost won last year. Last year, yeah. I don't know if everybody remembers, but I actually entered. It was called the Ultimate Fan Contest last right. year. Right. Yep. And I entered, and I was a semifinalist. They flew me out to 106 in Park. And I competed in a little competition they had there, and um, I didn't win, didn't make it to the BET Awards, but, you know, I tried again. And, and you made it. Yeah. Good girl. All right, let's recap. Lupe Fiasco, number four, out of my head. Number three, Kelly Rowland and Motivation. Don't forget, we're streaming live video online right now. You can watch Tiffany in the studio with me and hear the off-air conversation at FM98WJLB.com. Keyword, Bush Man. We got the top two songs coming up and your chance at tickets to the return of the OGs. Of the Credit Diva. Remember when the JLB vehicle got stolen? Oh, yeah, I do remember that. It became my car. Uh -huh. One news station said Bushman's car stolen, and then from there it became my car. I had police walking up to me asking me, did they, they find my car yet? I'm like, aren't you the police? Don't you oh, my God, <laughs> no. They, there's a blog saying that Chris Brown came back and threatened me and threatened everybody and said that, you know, I bet we better give the award to him and not Rihanna. And, oh, there's all kinds of stuff. Oh, yeah. I, I can only imagine. <laughs> And the thing about it, it and you know what's funny, remember when we were uh, in line to check in? Mm -hmm. And uh, when I left the hotel, you were at like 23,000 followers, and then you said, when we were there, you said, no, at 24. Mm -hmm. By the time we landed, you were like at like 25. I was like, Jesus, Pete. And, I, and then I think, and I, I think, I don't even know how you ended up getting that. Maybe from your emotional tweet backstage, mm -hmm. you know, and then all of a sudden, people just, I was like, but I was like, only thing I can think is, oh my God, if she's getting notifications to her phone for every oh, new flower, no. Thank follower. You, Lord. No, but I do have them coming to my email, so I can find any important emails. All it was was to the followers. I had to take that off. So. Oh. Yeah, because only thing I can think of is like your phone started smoking, <laughs> or, or you know, it or like started ticking or making noises, and you were like, oh my God. Minute and a half, we'll go back up. Yeah, that's the only thing I think of. I was like, because I would freak out. Because I freak out on Facebook when people put you in these groups and all of a sudden they start responding and you start getting like 30, 40 emails all of a sudden for xratedbooty.com, whatever like that. I'm like, and I gotta go leave the group. I'm like, why? Why am I in it? My name is Bush. You think I want to be in some sex? <laughs> Uh, in the building right now, Tiffany Green from the BET Awards. Uh, you may know her from... I hate that you're just, like, known for that. I mean, we got to come up with something else now. I mean, I'd rather be known for that than to just... Uh, like, like you fell down on stage or something oh, like that? Oh, that, that And I, I give you props because you, 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 you did your best to keep a smile on your face 
really? through the whole thing. <laughs> well, except for that one picture. But I swear they caught that. I don't know how they caught that. They caught it, and it's everywhere. Uh, yeah. And just let's, let's just hope. I just don't want it to come out on a t-shirt. But I want you to, like, figure out how we can trademark that so that yeah. if it does, That's you know, you, you get some money off that, you know. <laughs> so, in, in your own words, explain what exactly happened. Now, for me sitting in the audience, mm -hmm. you know, it looked... A, it looked like we were running late. Uh, I think Patty Lee Bell maybe went a little long in her mm -hmm. speech and she did her thing, but that's fine. And so I noticed that they didn't do and the nominees are. Right. Um, we actually had a dress rehearsal and, you know, I got a chance. Everything went smoothly. I actually had a chance in the dress rehearsal to give shout outs, you know, shout out Michigan, shout out my family and everything. As soon as I got backstage for the actual show, they said, we're running long. We have to cut your shout outs. You're just going to say the winner. So, you know, when I actually got on stage, they gave me the tablet. And um, Chris Brown was on the tablet as the winner. I announced that, but to the left of me, people actually told me you could hear the stage manager saying, just read the teleprompter, read the teleprompter. And on that, it said Rihanna. So immediately, I mean, this is live TV. I'm like, okay, so who won? What do I do? I was just... Right, and if you shocked. go back and you see the video, and you can, there's a, a, a screen that's right above where you guys were standing, mm -hmm. um, and it showed, like, when somebody won, it mm -hmm. showed their Twitter. Where oh, they could follow them at their Twitter and then it showed their names. Okay. And then it then it said Rihanna and Drake. So I was you know, we were all kinda like, Okay, wait, and then And then her music started playing. playing. So, like, and then she's not there and then Drake walks out. Right. And then you got Chris Brown right behind me on a bike, ready to roll out, and I'm like, This is awkward. Right. So But yeah. to clear everything up, the tablet which you were supposed to read off of Said, said Chris, Chris Brown. Brown. Yes. And then somebody on the teleprompter put Rihanna and Drake. Right. And then, of course, at the end of the award show, they came back out and said mm -hmm. that Chris Brown actually did win. Right. Craziness. Wow. That was right. You were right. Somebody else was wrong. So nobody hating on my girl Tiffany, all right? Listen, we're down to the number one song right now. DJ Khaled, Drake, Rick Ross, Lil Wayne, and I'm on one on JLB. JLB.com, Bushman. Tiffany Green in the building. BET Awards. Big fan. Nicki Minaj, big fan. We got I really hope that you get to meet her when she uh, comes to town. I definitely when you're When you're backstage. You, we got to make that happen. I appreciate you coming by and hanging out. And don't forget, you can check her out on Fox 2 at 5, mm -hmm. and then Access Hollywood at 6.30. At 6 so make sure you find out where that's on TV, and check out Tiffany Green and support your girl. And it was not her fault, all right? And uh, do big things. I, I hope that you take this situation and, uh, like I told you before, run with it, man. You got to, somebody just handed you the ball and just run right. Cause I know you, you, cause you're a songwriter and yeah. you do it. And I actually went to a um, performance arts school, so acting and hosting, corresponding—that's the field I want to be in. So, I mean, I got to do it, but it kind of right. got messed up. But you know. Well, at least you're getting this exposure right, right now. So, like I said, do whatever you can with it. Run with it. Take that ball. Go, go. Don't look back. Uh, don't worry about the haters. You know, sometimes you got to measure the level of your success by the level of the hate. When people right. want to hate on you, that means they're sitting around the dinner table having conversations about you while you're doing what you do when you do what you do. You know what I mean? Right. I just make my face at them. That's all. <laughs> there you go, baby girl. All right, thanks for stopping by. We're hanging out in the bushes. We're going commercial-free next. Keep it locked in to JLB. Or on the line, tickets to return of the OGs. Make sure you are writing them down. Four, three, two, one. So I got a special guest in the studio. We didn't exactly fly out to Cali together, but we flew back together. And I, I'm going to tell the story about, well, first of all, introducing Tiffany Green, the infamous Tiffany Green. Hey, 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 what's going on? World famous now, Tiffany Green. She's doing too much right now. So I was telling people around here how when you were uh, entering the contest for BET, mm -hmm. how you tweeted me support you and I retweeted you and actually went and voted for you. You did, thank and you. And then I get out to California to find out that you won. Yeah. So okay. tell everybody what the contest exactly was and what did you have to do to uh, to be on, be on the, the awards? Um, well, it was called the Your World, Our World contest. And um, basically you just had to enter a video or a photo collage of something interesting about you, a day in your life as what? And I did a day in the life of a Nicki Minaj fan, um, which I'm a huge fan, shout out to Team Minaj. 
and yeah so that's what I did people got to vote on it for about a week and I got the most votes so I won and congratulations for you Thank winning you. And did you did you get to meet Nikki? I didn't. You know what? I you know she was winking. She I, was she was blowing me kisses the entire time I was on stage. Once they told her, you know, I was one of her, one of her fans. So just being able to be in the same room as her and see her and everything that was that was enough for me. But no, I didn't get to meet her. So. Uh, okay, we're gonna have to make that happen though. I'm gonna meet her. I got backstage passes to her show when she comes to the palace on the 28th. Oh, so, so you will get to meet so her. So I get to meet her then. Yeah. All right, cool. Now there's a lot of things going on with you. And I want you to be able to explain to everybody what happened at the awards with all the controversy and everything right. like that. Mm -hmm. But we're going to do that in just a minute, so y'all stay right there. We're going on in the countdown. Number three. Oh, I'm sure nobody will forget this face. Now, <laughs> <laughs> now that's not the face that, that that one picture. I mean, and I bet you that picture that they ca capture of you was like a split oh second gosh, where you look like you were like... Between, I see her caught in the headlights. Yeah, pissed, confused, yeah. mad, angry, emotional. And it's everywhere, and like the captions that people are putting are just so funny. Oh, crazy. Now, I was telling somebody like yesterday, I said, watch, wait. You might want to, I don't know if you could do it because Trade somebody else, yeah. Everybody was saying that. I don't know if you can do it because somebody else took the picture, so they kind of own the picture. Right. But I would investigate whether they're not because somebody's gonna come out with that as a t-shirt. Yeah, I know. Like Angela 